welcome to Lunchtime Live. My name is Sam, and today we'll be doing some training with Norris, our woodchuck, also known as the groundhog. So in the wild, um, woodchucks are known for digging. They dig big burrow systems. And so this training just lets Norris have the opportunity to exhibit those natural behaviors. So come along with me and watch Norris dig and learn about how it's actually really important for our environment. Norris, dig. So groundhogs are great diggers and they dig these elaborate burrow systems that they use to rear their young, hibernate, um, and just stay safe from predators. They make multiple entrances, designated toilet chambers, and even dead ends to deter and confuse predators. Dig. And so these burrows go down pretty deep because they need to get below the frost line for when the woodchucks or groundhogs are hibernating under there. So at least over four feet, but usually up to six feet deep. And when they do vacate these burrows, they're actually very important homes for other animals, things like skunks, um, rabbits and hares, and foxes. So they're kind of ecosystem engineers in a way. They provide habitat for other animals. Dig. So groundhogs like to live in open areas like pastures and prairies. Um, so human activities like forest clearing and agriculture um, provide habitat for them. Good. And also food for them. So their numbers are able to increase. So they're often seen as a nuisance animal um, because when they come out of hibernation, when they're going in, they lose about 30 to 40% of their body weight. So they really need to beef up. Uh, so they need to eat a lot of food and they tend to eat people's crops. But their ability to dig um, makes them able to provide a really important ecosystem service. So when they're getting down in there and digging around, they're mixing up the soil and aerating it, which improves soil quality for things like plants to grow in. Dig. It also increases soil absorption. So when it rains, the soil is able to absorb more water and there's less runoff. Good. And we know runoff can carry pollutants to water sources. So it's really important that we have uh, nice aerated soil that groundhogs provide. Fun fact about groundhogs is that they're actually responsible for discovering two different archaeological dig sites in the U.S. One in Ohio and one in Pennsylvania. And that's because they get down so deep that they actually brought up to the surface artifacts, things like pottery, stone, and bones, and because we found them, because the groundhogs brought them up, we were able to excavate those sites. So thank you for joining me today and spending some time with Norris um, and learning all about how groundhog's ability to dig can improve our ecosystem, our environment. Okay, <laughs>